In order to better understand the writing process, we want to go through the stages of the writing process. If you understand each stage, it'll make the whole process much easier. So the stages of writing begin with one pre-writing. Pre-writing, as it indicates in the word there, means you're not writing anything down. This stage is where you are gathering and generating your ideas. You are brainstorming, you're reading literature, you're creating life maps, web, story charts, uh, you're deciding on the form and the audience, the purpose, you're developing word banks. All of this is pre-writing. Before you've ever even started putting anything down, you've got to gather this big heap of information and make a few decisions before you even put pen to paper. So pre-writing is critical. So you've generated your ideas, you've developed your word bank, you've decided on the form, the audience, the purpose. The next thing to do then is drafting. So this is where you actually start writing everything down. At this stage, you are not concerned at all with neatness or with conventions. You just want to get the information down that you gathered in pre-writing. So get the information and the ideas down on paper in some form. It doesn't have to be neat. It doesn't have to follow conventions. Just get it written. Once you have it down, so your pre-writing's done, you've drafted it, then in the revising process is where you start to improve it. You add things, imagery, details. You remove things that are superfluous or unnecessary. Uh, here you can actually work with others uh, to get their ideas, their input. Hey, I don't think you needed to say this three times. You can remove this part. Or why don't you add more here? I wanted to understand better what was going on here. Or, you know, this is kind of vague or there's some details you can add. So when you revise your draft, this is where you actually bring the improvement by additions, imagery, details, and getting rid of that which is superfluous. After you've revised, then you have to go to the editor. And here you're looking for uh, putting it in final form in good shape. So you're checking for spelling errors, grammatical errors. This is the mechanics. So this is not actually about the story being good. This is about it looking good on paper or digitally. However the person is going to consume it reading wise, it needs to look good. It's very distracting to read something that's riddled with spelling errors, grammatical errors, punctuation errors. It breaks it up and keeps people from actually enjoying the story that you're trying to tell. So editing is critical. Once the editing has been taken place, you send it to the publisher, who then publishes it. And there is actually a final step. You think, well, whew, you know, I've done my pre-writing, I've drafted, I've revised, I've edited, I've sent it to the publisher, I'm done. But actually, there's one final step in the writing process, and that's evaluation. What is the final assessment of the work? How did I do? How can I improve? Am I going to write another book? These sorts of things. So. Uh, evaluation is the critical final step in writing. So uh, these are the, the six steps, six stages in the writing process. If you'd like to learn more underneath this video, you'll find a link to a website that'll take you there where they have that information. And also on that website, you'll find a link to an ebook that's ready for immediate download.